Taking lockdown as an opportunity to smash out some DIY jobs around the house. So, what are some of the best, quick and affordable ways to jazz up your home without spending a fortune? We can get everything you need from Bunnings. And Sarah Stewart is with Brad the Builder to show us just how easy it could be. Hey, Sarah. <laughs> Hey, good morning to you. Well, if you have been to the Bunnings in the last few weeks, you will know this is how Aussies are spending their weekends, their days at the moment. So, Brad, we need some quick and easy ideas for the weekend. First of all, if the kids have kicked a hole in the fly screen, what do we do? Well, it's a pretty easy fix. I mean, you just go down to Bunnings and you pick up some nylon mesh, you get the existing frame, you take it out, you cut it to the exact same hole. Now, when you pull out the rubber, it's going to be like this. You just use a roller to roll it back into the existing frame. All done. All done. OK, kitchen. We've got some old, ugly handles. What can we do? Yep, well, handles, pretty simple. You can actually get the colours and different profiles. The biggest tip I can give you about is make sure the holes line up with the existing holes on your actual cupboards. Because if you don't, you're going to have to patch up a hole. It's not going to look any good. So buy a handle that matches your old. OK, lots of people want to do things. Money is obviously very tight at the moment. If we've been thinking about doing the kitchen, the cupboards, the benches, we can't quite afford it, yep. what can we do now? Well, kits like this are actually fantastic. You give it a sand up, you use the base coat and the activator, you follow the prompts, follow the instructions, and before you know it, you've got a brand new bench top. Aussies love being outside on decks like we're on today. They yep. need a stain though, don't they? Oh, they do, including the one we're standing <laughs> on right now. Now, what I recommend is you use a good deck clean. It actually opens the pores, brings out all the dirt, give it a gurney. The next day, you give it a good oil. Now, you should do it every single year. But if you ask me, I reckon you should do it every six months. It'll look brand new all the time. And you don't need to use a paintbrush, do you? One of these? No, nah, one of those mops. <laughs> it's fantastic. You just mop it on. This is one of my favourites. For $5, if you've got that mouldy seal on the yep. bottom of your shower, that's all you need, isn't it? That's it. You just trim it to size, clip it back on, throw the old one. I like that one. Excellent. OK, outside again, we've got the decorative screen over here. Talk yep. me through what you can do with that. I mean, those things are great. You actually buy different profiles, different sizes, place them throughout your garden. It actually completely transforms your whole backyard. It looks fantastic. These are all cheap, easy things you can do over a weekend, but I just want to do a quick warning Definitely. to people. There are some things you shouldn't attempt yourself, aren't there? Well, that's the thing. When it comes to sort of more construction and doing anything structural, that's for sure. You need to get a proper builder in or a carpenter or someone's a qualified tradesman. Get them to do the work. But anything simple, definitely give it a go while you're in, while you're in isolation. Because there's lots of little tools as well you can use as, the, as well. Like, I like this. Yep. This is to put your handles on, isn't it? That's it. Now, that's great if you've got a fresh, brand new door, so you actually can re-drill exactly where your new handles go, or if you want to repaint your doors and patch the old hand, the old hole. But other than that, use a handle that has the exact same hole spacings. Then you won't go, go wrong. Great advice. Now, guys, yep. I've got lots of projects to do this weekend. If hubby's watching, this is what I want for Mother's Day. Mm. Wow. OK, Get there you go. Work. You can't uh, deny a Mother's Day wish. <laughs> um, I think I know the answer to this, but are you handy, DC? <laughs> what? Look at those hands. <laughs> These hands. Yeah, look, yeah. Those look hands. no, uh, no, <laughs> no. I, I struggle in that area. No, well, let's face it. It's not the only area I struggle in. We'll speak to my wife later on.